Hi everyone, Rick Bray with BT BOCES Instructional Support, and in this video I'd like to show you about the rich text editor in Schoology. Uh, now this is going to be applying to assessment questions, so here I am in, in, in a quiz that I made, uh, and you can see it's a multiple choice question, I've set my answer, everything's great. The rich text editor, that's basically all of these options at the top of my text that allows me to uh, make the text a little more complicated in terms of changing the font or changing the size, maybe making it a uh, subscript, superscript, inserting media, all that kind of stuff. That's that's what the rich text editor is. And what we've heard from a lot of teachers is, well, that's great, I can do it for my question, but I really wish I could do that for the answer choices, uh, or like I wish I could make pictures for answer choices, and you can. So this is a feature that's been in Schoology for a while, and it's just kind of hidden, which is what made itself apparent to us recently. Uh, you'll notice when you mouse over one of your answer choices, a little pencil appears to the right-hand side of the answer choice itself. That is what allows you to bring in the rich text editor. And you'll see for this answer choice, I now have all of those options that I didn't have before, including if I wanted, instead of having text for an answer, I can now insert a media uh, and insert a picture just like I did before. So that's great, especially for young learners, because now you can tell them to click on the correct picture or choose the correct picture. It's awesome. Uh, so that's great for multiple choice questions. Uh, what I also wanted to show you is students can have the ability within a short answer or essay question uh, right here allow the rich text answers for students, right? Uh, if by checking that box, they'll now have the ability to add in all of these to their answers. Uh, so that's really beneficial for things like math class where they can get into equations and latex editor, or they can simply put in a picture of their own. So there you go. You now have the ability uh, to put in rich text answer choices in assessments, uh, and actually you have had that ability, but there's where it is. Uh, and also you can give students the ability to put in rich text answers into their assessment answers. Uh, so as always, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact either Taylor or myself, and thank you for watching.